Hello everyone, this is MK here, and today we have some exciting news, and um, when I mean, even though it's July, a Comic Con has revealed that um, this Ninjago, Ninjago Season 8 sneak peek, and also Comic Con has also revealed a second Lego Ninjago movie trailer, but I'm not going to talk about th that in this video, but but in this video, I'm going to talk about this sneak peek of Ninjago Season 8. So, uh, yeah. So, I'm going to tell you what happened, and then I will tell, um, you what I actually, you know, think about it. And remember, this is just my opinion and everything. So, uh, yeah. So, um, uh, there, not that much happened, actually, but, but it, it don't worry, it's awesome, but, um, not not that much happened like it's seven minutes long and uh yeah but it started off with the scene like people celebrating and all the fireworks and all and i actually found that pretty neat like it has some awesome effects like in good animation which you know which uh sadly hands of time poorly execute uh you know that but um yeah but uh yeah then um Surprisingly enough, like I I, I can't believe they revi actually revealed the villain so early. Like I know, like uh, I think it was like a couple of years ago, uh, they they did have like a a sneak peek for Skybound, but they didn't actually reveal what the villains were or what the main villain was. And uh, yeah, but we get to know what like what the villains are this early. <laughs> And I can't believe it at at all. And um yeah. But but uh yeah. So these like these are like these um fully equipped uh soldier kinda they're not like ninja or samurai or anything, but they're 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 at the but they do have like some ninja skills and, and, and stuff and they look like uh Power Rangers or whatever. But, um, uh, yeah, so, so, what they're really after is that mask in poor Bork's tower. So, of course, they did sneak around and, um, yeah, went, uh, and pass through these artifacts like, um, um, you know, Nakon's, um, golden, uh, statue, which, I, 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 I'm really confused because Skybound didn't really exist, but, uh, yeah, and also, um, and yeah, they went, and they, and we saw some Kabuki mask and that, you know, little, I don't know, what, what I call, I should call it, like, a, uh, museum or something, I don't know, it's like a, where they protect their art, artifacts, but, um, however, they, I, they actually saw what they looking f uh, f um, for at a you know at a uh, painting of Borg himself, and they cut it, and they just cut through that with their with or one of them cut through that with his sword, and yeah, poor poor man, whoever painted that that spent a lot of time painting that. I know we end up got got some money, but <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And yeah, they find their Kabuki mask, which I'm gonna call it for now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and of course they, there were some like lasers, but they uh, blocked it with their swords. And yeah, of course the alarm, um, you know, went, um, went off. And then yeah, they, uh, they decide to get off the building before they caught. And but um. But, however, Lloyd was outside, and, uh, yeah, we have this epic chase, or, you know, fight scene, or whatever you call it. And, um, and, uh, yeah, Lloyd actually ends up, um, uh, he, he, he ends up catching most of the villains, well, pretty much all of them, except one, and, um, and, yeah, and there was this, like, epic, like, Okay, so we we actually had 
we actually had a good look at some of the 2018 sets. And I'm really excited. Um, okay, Lloyd's have his awesome car. And then this uh, vil and that main villain uh, has this awesome uh, bike. And uh, yeah, there was a huge chase. And however, um, Lloyd was, wasn't was able to get um, uh, stopped him. But uh, yeah, the guy with the poop. <laughs> Kabuki mask uh, got away, so, um, uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, yeah, he, he got away with it, and, uh, yeah, and then the, um, uh, the entire sneak peek, and then said, Nujaro, Sons of Garbodon, which might be the title for the season or the episode, but I don't know, I, I believe it's the entire season, but, uh, yeah, so I now I told you what happened in the sneak peek, and but what but what do I think about it? Well, for one thing, I I know it's gonna be better than Hands of Time, and here's why. Like, not only well, I like like just the very fact that the Hangman Bros are back and uh, everything. And, and yeah, I, like, I really missed them, and also, um, and they had this old Ninjago feel, like, it, it, it feels right again. Like, like, the writing for Ninjago Hands of Time, it didn't felt right, right, but, uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, and you guys probably know what I'm going to talk about next. Uh, I'll give you five seconds to guess. Oh yes, I'm going to talk about Lloyd. So, <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, what about Lloyd? Um, okay, so he changed quite a bit, and that makes sense because this takes years after season seven. So, yeah, of course he's going to uh, have some changes. But what's odd is that his character design is similar to. The Lego Ninjago movie, you know, uh, uh, Lloyd. So, uh, and also, by the way, his voice changed. And, yeah, uh, he no longer has that female voice. I forgot what her name was. She did a good job, but I, I guess it's time for a man voice. Because, you know, he has to sound like a man. Especially, like, I don't know, I guess 10 years after... Uh, season 7, yeah, they definitely need a man voice. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, he can't sound like, like a kid forever. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. But, what's weird is that Lloyd has his green eyes just like in the movie. <laughs> and, uh, I, <laughs> I, I feel like it's weird. There's no way to explain that, that or no way, unless they, uh, has some backstory, but I don't think they're going to do that. <laughs> but, like, I don't think they're going to explain, um, oh yeah, why did, did Lloyd had green eyes? <laughs> and he has the same hair as the movie, which, um, yeah, I actually do like. And for the mask, um, he, and for the mask, like, uh, I, I thought it looked a bit mediocre, but I kind of got used to it. Like, I like that lime green and stuff with the black. And, uh, yeah, it looked cool. And now to the villains. So, the villains are, again, these crypt uh, people. They're not ninja or samurai. Well, have some ninja skills, but, uh, yeah. But however, the main one, or the one that escaped, I, I believe it's Lloyd's brother. And the reason why is that the title says Sons of Garmadon. And it will be interesting if, if, um, if the main villain was an actual sibling of one of the ninjas. And, uh, I, I think Ninjago didn't, didn't really did that before, so... It will be some awesome character development there. And, uh, yeah. 
Of course, uh, I don't know if it's going to cause some plot holes or anything because, uh, we, because it's most likely that, uh, Gombardon and Masako only had one child. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I, I, I guess it's not a plot hole if they had two children. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so, um, uh, yeah. What's cool? Like, okay, so, so we know nothing about those six, uh, villains that we saw in the sneak, the sneak peek. So, um, uh, yeah, like, and, of course, uh, the main one got away with the Kabuki mask. And, um, uh, yeah, so, so, uh, yeah, so. Like, okay, so I'm going to talk about his, you know, actual look. Like, I like his two red eyes. But one thing bugged me, however, like, for, like, those six. Like, I, I, I found a bit mediocre, like, when, because of the, their, like, uh, classic helmets. And they had it printed. I, I don't know, it just looks weird. But I, I actually like them, by the way, like... I'm pretty sure they're gonna look cool in the sets. Uh, that that's what I think, and I'm probably gonna have new helmets. I, I don't think they're the the official. It, yeah, they're just their biking helmets. I don't know, but uh, yeah. So yeah, so yeah, there was barely any dialogue with the villains at all. Uh, I wonder. <laughs> Maybe for the first time ever, we will have villains that won't talk at all. I don't know. I don't know. They're just quiet, quieter than the ninjas themselves. Ha ha. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so. So, yeah, then again, I, I just, I, I like it so far. I know it's different, but I, I just like it. And I like the new feel to it. Like, the Hangman Bros are back. So, I have high hopes for this season. So, uh, yeah. So, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like. And also, please comment, uh, what you think about this season. And, um, why not subscribe? So, yeah. This is MK here. And, I'm out of here. Bye bye <laughs>